Okay. So we'll continue with Hilkas Bosa Bechalosim and Tzadik Dalat Siv Gimel. We've been speaking about several examples of inserting a kaf cholevis into a flesh kapat, a milachis flesh kapat, or the other way around, where this could pose a problem to the kaf, to the tafshil, and to the gdero. Those are the three things that we're concerned about. Therefore, whenever this happens, or whenever such a shana does happen in the kitchen, it's good to remember that the shana that concerns three possibilities, three actually kalim, or two kalim and one tafshil. It's, it's not just one. It's actually several items that can be affected. We're concerned about the food. We're concerned about what do we do with the pot? What do we do with the spoon? Well, usually with the spoon and with the pot, it may not be a big deal because Hagal is always there to the rescue. In case you have to do anything about the kelim, you put it aside. Worst comes to worst, one keli is not a big deal. If it's such a keli that you can do Hagal or two, or Libun, anytime you have a question or a problem with kashas, trefes, and so forth, you know, Hagal and Libun is something that can correct the problem. But when you're dealing with a tough shell, you can't really correct it. You can't really fix it. Either you're going to throw it in the wastebasket, uh, in the garbage, I should say, or you're, uh, you know, going to give it away to a goy. Sometimes that may be possible. And uh, sometimes you can eat it and not be worried about it. Basa b'cholob is also behano, so you can't even feed it to your dog. Right? The food, that is, so the tafshil that we're concerned about. So that's the only difference between Basar Bechol, at least one major difference between Basar Bechol and Shari Surim, Megabe Hano. But th- that is the, the termination that we need to make when something like this happens. How do we, go to, how do we evaluate the situation if it's Basar and Motor? Well, we have to ask a bunch of questions. One of the questions we'll be concerned with is that Kaylee, the, the spoon, is it a, a Benyam or a Eno Benyam? That can make a big difference. Because we hold no sin tamrif gam mutar. But the Evet, of course, the whole thing is a the Evet. You're not supposed to use spoon that even though you haven't used it for six months. So what? It's still a milchik spoon. But if it turns out to be that you haven't used it for at least 24 hours, that's already a big gula. And that already tells you right away, forget about calculating how much there was in the tafshul. You don't even have to deal with that problem. It's already mutar. The tafshul is mutar. Not only is the tafshul mutar, the kdera is going to be mutar too. The spoon, however, itself? No. The spoon, we're not going to just tell you you can just do nothing about it. Because that spoon, even though, even though it's, uh, it's an Eino B'Yoyma, it right now has Blias of Bosa Becholov in it. Even though one of those Blias is a Nois and Tam Gam, that's true. And perhaps if it were to happen again, a mistake of you would be inserting it into something else that you're not supposed to insert it, it was like to bust her again, right? You wouldn't have a problem because, as we will see soon, it's a noise and tamlef gam in there. The hull of there is a noise and tamlef gam. But that's not so partial. We will see. We don't know that, right? But what we understand so far is if noise and tamlef gam is motor, that, that would be is that even though later on it absorbs the other kind of tam, in other words, let's say you have a kaf choy levis, and it absorb, and it's already past 24 hours, and it absorbs meat, right? If you were to insert it now, later on, by mistake, into meat, you wouldn't have a problem either, just like you didn't have it the first time. You're not supposed to, but if you did, you're not going to have a problem. And that's one of the details that we'll cover today. What happens if, nevertheless, but the Ebed, one was not supposed to, but he inserted it anyway. So there's a difference between, of course, the chatzil and the evan and the and tam gam. So that's the case of tam that is pogum. But here you have another situation. In Sif Gimel, you have a situation that, there, that we're dealing with a problem here. It, it was a ben yoyma. It was used this morning. However, I may be able to get away with it, but not because of tam of gam. It was used ben for a different reason. My second step is to figure out how much is there in the Kedera. Second step. And the answer is just shishim or more. Would, are there any additional steps besides shishim and enum and Yeah, possibly. There are other kind of criteria. <laughs> We're not dealing with hot stuff. It's not yatsu lettuce, boy. It's cold. What are you worried about it? Oh, no, I took a flesh of a spoon to eat my, my Cheerios and milk. What would you say to your daughter if she tells you that? I used a flesh of a spoon, daddy, to eat my 
Cheerios and milk. Ah, oh, it's okay. Yeah, it is. It's toinen. It's not hot. No problem. Rinse the spoon. You can have your Cheerios. Don't worry about shishin. Don't worry about any banyoma. It's toinen. So there are other criteria. I mean, we may have here and there other situations which could, which could, uh, of course, make the case either easier or more complicated. But it, obviously, if it's not Yatzer Lettuce Boy, Yatzer Lettuce Boy is the dividing line, then it may not be such a problem. Klisheni, and so forth, or cold, or whatever. So here in Sif Gimel, Halacha Gimel, we're talking about the same, more or less, scenario of Aleph and Beis, if Aleph and Beis, just that we're dealing with the three Shishim. So there, it is a Ben Yoimoy. Me Shishim Levatel Akaf. You do have shishim to mevata the kasha. The day of the tavshil mutarin, the pot and the tavshil are mutar. But a kaf also, the says, the kaf is also benim basar, benim cholov. You can't use it with either one. From now on, you have to kasher it. You can't use it until you kasher it. Now with basar, now with cholov. Lefisha who? Lefisha he. Blue of me basar bechol because it has the two tamim in that kaf in that spoon. So when he says, oh, so here we're talking about Ben Yoimah, remember, yeah. In this particular way? example right now, it's not just two Tamim, because if I say two Tamim, it could be the one is Nois and Tam of Gam. So it's more than just two Tamim, you actually have Basra Becholov as so an Isra. Yeah, you actually, have, you actually have the Isra of Basra Becholov, yes, you're right. You're, in this case, because it's Ben Yoimah, you don't have just two tamim of basar becholov. You actually have the real iser basar becholov in that spoon. So thank you for clarifying that a little bit. Yeah. No, no, no. Yeah, but that's true because you do have other cases where it will be aser because you have the two tamim there. Even though one of those tamim is eno ben yoimar. In if gimel, what's making it mutter is you have shishim. The problem is you're dealing with still with the situation of ben yoimar. So. So the Gdair and Tafshil are fine, but that Taf, the Kaf, for some reason, we need to explain that, is blue on the boss of the a filu be the Eved, therefore, the Mechaber says, since it's, bos, it's blue on the boss of the Cholov, a filu be the Eved, the Seres, it will answer once again, im Chosru with the Chuvuo, bein the boss of the Cholov. If you take that spoon that now has boss of the Cholov in it, fresh boss of the Cholov, and you take it, and by mistake, of course, you insert it into another Kedera of Basar or of Cholov, either one, it's going to ask her, you're going to need Shishim again. Kozman Shihi Bas as long as it's by Yoyma, Vim Ein Shishim, and there's no Shishim where you're putting it in, a call will be Asr. As long as that spoon, on the same day, it's Bas Yoyma, you went ahead and put it in again by mistake, and there's no Shishim in that pot, it's going to be a problem. It's going to be Asr, not only to eat, it's going to be Asr Behano. Hafilok Dera is going to be also Behano, because there's no Shishim, so it's not just a spoon, even the the Tavshil. Right? So when you have a spoon that is a Ben Yoimoy, that has, therefore, Bli as a Basar Becholov, Ben Yoimoy, everything is Ben Yoimoy, there was no Shishim, so the Gdera, the Tavshil, would be also too. In the first example, in the first part of Sigimo, there was shishi, so you, the top shul and the are okay, but the spoon is not. So therefore, that spoon that is not okay, were you to insert it again in another gedera, whether it's milchik or fleishik gedera, if that other gedera does not have shishi, you're going to have a problem. Not only a problem with the food, not only a problem with the gedera, but it's going to be also behano, because we're talking about the isra basar becholov here. What can you do, other than try to fix this keli, and you may be able to sell it, according to some poiskim, to a goy. Achmutur losses the toicha you can put into it perot, fruit, or so on and something cold. Kivan she'ino nehena me gufa iser. Since you're not really benefiting directly from the gufa iser, the gufa iser here is balua in the gedera. So you're not enjoying benefiting from basar becholov. You're not deriving a direct benefit from the basar becholov because the basar becholov here is in the form of a balia. It's absorbed into the gedera. So you're putting something. It's sitting in the in the gedera. In this, in this vessel. That's not called Hano. The Mechaber says, Paris or Tzonin, what would be, uh, th- there's a whole shiloh about liquids. Can you, can you do it with liquids? Some say it on a temporary basis. You could. Some say it shouldn't be a problem. Either way, we're talking about something cold. 
since there's no direct benefit from it, it wouldn't be a problem. All right. Now, so we have to understand this calf. The calf that was inserted, there was no, there was shishim. Since there was shishim, the there in the taf shalamotar. The calf remains also. So we brought up the question as to why don't we say hagala to the calf? Hagala technically does take place. I mean, it, it, that's how you do agala, don't you? I mean, you stick it into hot boiling liquid of sorts. It doesn't have to be water. We use water, of course. So this should be a form of agala. I mean, technically, why does the calf have to remain usher if there was shishim? There's no shishim, I understand, but there's no, there was shishim. So if there's shishim and the shishim helps the there, it helps the tafsha, why doesn't it help the, the calf too? Like you pretty much also asked. It, it, it should be able to extricate if we can use that word, the entire calf in the calf. That's what Shishim does. And, 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 that's, and, and that would be a form of Agala. I mean, that's how Agala would be performed. So that's, that's one of the, the kudas that is mentioned here in the Taz. So I'll read it inside. It's a short one. Velo Amrina, the Taz says, the Mashinit Kvar that was already inserted, Habik Agala. We don't say that that should be Agala. Why not? Tiretz Bagol Sharidura, the Hagola, real Hagola, Siricho Roiskin, Shemaale Reticha. You need boiling, boiling water that is very, very much boiling, that you see the Reticha coming up, you see it bubbling. When it comes to the Indian Isur, when it comes to making something, also all you need is Oyseraki Mayatsa Ladas Boy. All you need is if Yatsa Ladas Boy. In other words, for something to become Asur, it could become Asur even if Yatsa Ladas Boy. Well, a real Hagola requires Reticha. So therefore, you may have different levels here. You don't necessarily have the level that's required for Hagala in this pot right now that is very hot. In other words, it could be hot enough to make something usher, but maybe not boiling hot to accomplish Hagala. So, in other words, he's moide that in principle, in Okinami, that would be a possibility. According to this, according to the Taz Sharidura, if you knew for sure it's boiling, I mean, technically it may be okay. So he's not saying no. He's just saying that since the requirements are different, we assume, or we, it just may be very possible that you did not have the required heat in this pot to perform Hagola. He also adds at the end, the, 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 the Oselemite, you may also make a mistake, you know. Hello? It's like a low plug? Yes, he says it's a low plug, basically. You don't, you know. Also, he says at the end, also, you may make a mistake as a result of that. Uh, what kind of a mistake? All kinds of mistakes in the requirements of Agola. What, what, is, you know, what is really needed? What, you know, what did you have? And it says that's one terence, or two, two terutsim, actually, in the Taz. Also, the Mite is the second one. They may come, you may come to make a mistake as a result of that uh, in, in allowing this kind of Agola. But there are other terutsim. I did see another terence. I think it's Rabbeinu Peretz that sometimes what happens when people stick in the wrong spoon is they don't stick it all the way in, obviously. So you didn't really have Hagola of the whole keili. You had Hagola of per- perhaps a portion of the keili, but not the whole thing. So th- there are other terutsim. Yeah. I did see, Ilan, what you mentioned the other day about Cholov. There is one opinion. Says, How could you use Cholov to be Magil Basar? Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. But that's, it's, it's, it's possible. It's possible. Yeah, yeah, but it's not a, you know, it's not a, it's not a technical Terrets. It's just that it's a, you know, it's a svara of why you wouldn't allow it. But the other ones are more technical. In, in, in other words, like Rabbeinu Peretz says, I mean, you may not be able, you may not have stuck in the whole thing. So how could you even say that this should be a gala? Perhaps you didn't do it right without introducing the idea that cholov doesn't just cut it, as they say in English, with basa. I mean, how could you use cholov? But I think this is pretty much a, a good enough explanation of what the Taz brings here for why this would not be Hagala. Okay. Also, it like, has to actually have, uh, what do you call them, uh, bubbles. That's what we said, Resicha, Mala Resicha. That was the yeah. first explanation in the Tanz. Okay. Yeah, sure. Okay, the Prima Godin says here, in this case, when you have a Kaf in Yerma, and you have the Blia of Bosa, so it becomes a form of Hanan, it becomes all Nevela, you cannot put that into other macholim. And that is true even if you waited 24 hours, right? 
with this spoon and it became pumpkin, you cannot put it in other machalim. Because the chacham were geyser, lechatchila and noise and tamlet gan. But had there been already more than 24 hours gone by from the initial blia of cholov, then it doesn't become an avela, even though it has the blias of the two. Okay? That's the second example of you have the blias of bas of the cholov, but the blias of the cholov in the spoon, right, is not within 24 hours of the blias of the basar. So it's already noise and tamlev gam. So that... Technically, you could use it for other ma'acholim, not for basar ocholov. Right? We learned that before. That technically, the machaber holds, you would be able to use it with vegetables. Right. But it's a minhag. The, the, the Ramos pretty much says uh, the minhag is not to use it with anything. Even though what you have here, the primagodim says, is cholov, that's pogum already, later on absorbing basar. So you have the two bliyas, the two tamim inside. And therefore, even though one is pogum, you cannot use it with either vaser or chalav. The same halacha, you cannot lechatchila use it with vaser or chalav. But you can lechatchila use it with other macholim actually, to use it with other macholim to stir fry something else, vegetables. The Ramo is machmer. I mean, it's a meaning to be machmer not to use it until you make hagala to it. Right? But I think there was the Ram Eino ben Yomo pot that was used to visit. We'll, we'll talk about that. Good point. We'll talk about the I difference. Was, I think was no, no, no. Yeah, we'll talk about the difference between how something became or how something absorbed pog- the gimel. Was it pogum to begin with, or did it get something pogum into it? Mm-hmm. That we'll, we'll talk about that soon. Yeah. Okay. So so far so good. This is a very easy halacha, and same thing with Siv dalit. But there's a good there's a good question here. I thought that we should talk, discuss this question. The Chavas Das asked a very good question here, according to the Ramot that we saw in Siv Beis. Remember the Ramon? See, Beis, the Ramon basically says, ah, you stuck it in twice, that spoon, you can, all, you can always be fine with one time shisha. Chuma Sadeshan. And we explained that over there, over there, there's a tziruf. There are various reasons to be makal there. Even though, you know, it appears that, that and there's always a chashash, that something was left over of the milk. You know, that's the whole chashash to begin with. Something was left over and became chanan. He says like this, first of all, not everybody holds chanan in the, in the bliyas. Okay? Not everybody right. holds chanan in the bliyas. Now, besides that, here, the basar that's being absorbed into the spoon, as long as it's inside, it's makusher to the basar. Right? It's connected. It's not becoming chanan when you're putting in the spoon. The second time, right? You're putting in the spoon. That basar that it's in the spoon is connected to the basar in the pot. Are you going to say you're going to take it out? Then it's going to become chanan. At the that point that you take it out, it's a clear shame. Okay. So that's how we explain the Ramah is mako. There is reason enough to be mako besides the other, besides the ones who hold that. You know what? Not everybody agrees that there is chanan in Belias to begin with, even though we're machmir. But he does require six. Yes, yes, yes. I didn't understand your Kenny argument with um, after it was back in time. I didn't understand that, that would would need one times the or two times six because it's becoming a cliche already be out of after it's separated. And once it's separated from the tough shield, I don't care how much I have the tough shield respect to what happens with this. No, but the only concern f- now is if I in- reinsert it. Oh, so you're going to insert the third time? The thir- yeah, exactly. Th- second or third time. No, I thought the pure describing the spoon is removed from the tunnel. Yeah. Was already after the second. Yes, that's correct. What well, was after the second? After the second insertion, that's correct. And we're talking about how much quantity, much volume of food up at the time of the second. So. As soon as you remove. But once you remove it after the second. Yeah. So why would I, what would the, the spoon after I remove it after the second do with the volume of food at the time it's in, before it was removed? Well, it's the same thing. I mean, we're calculating the, the pot, right? We're trying to be machshir the pot. I don't understand. No, yeah, we're, we're we're trying to say what's going to be the din of the pot, right? The top. So forget about the spoon right now, because the right, spoon, after I removed the the spoon, yes. How would the spoon affect either the pot or the food? The only thing that can now be affected is the spoon. The, the spoon has to be in, in the pot and in the top shell, insert the top shell in the pot. The spoon is inserted a second time, but the a time you time. insert it a second time... Now that I remove Now, 
No, you removed it the first time. Ah, so the removal went on the first time. Yes, the, 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 problem, the problem that is... The problem on the spoon is as a result of the removal the first time. Ah, so then I misunderstood you. I understood sure, so. you to say that right. the removal was after the second time. No, no, no. That's for some other reason I said that. that that's, in other words, okay, okay maybe it wasn't clear. Right, right, right. Now, that even if you remove it this, the second time, it could, there could be a third time. It makes no difference. Yeah, but, but you're right. It's just a repeat, of the, just a repeat of the first one. Yeah, it happens already from the first time around. There, yeah, you're right. Anyway, so, so the Chavaz Das has a good question. Based on that reasoning, for which we're matir, the Ramon is matir, that all you need is one times 60. He says, why don't we apply that over here too? He says like this. But we're still having a situation where I only need the, the second making it 120 if it's yes. no no no. no no, but we've said no, no, that doesn't make a difference. I no, always need 120 put it in. No, oh, no, no, according to the Mechaber, yes. It makes a difference, no, 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 But no, those who say it doesn't say no, 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 the Ramas says it doesn't say no, he only requires 60, he doesn't Right, require it. exactly. So the, the, the requirement of an additional 60 would be right. on the condition of... That's correct, yeah, only no, no, no. Correct, yeah. But if the but condition no. for 60 is no, 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 as whether it was cliché or whatever, all these options, why do why why do they get a role when I'm only saying I need an additional sixty? Was so you argue with me and you tell me yeah, but it's not a cliche. It's a cliche. Then I should also need it if it was noida. So if if if, it, if the noida is here, the condition under which I'll need a second yeah. sixty, or I won't need a sixty. Noida is not a problem according to anyone. Once you have noida, no. If it's right? noida, yes. If right. noida, it's the, the second right. sixty. Right. So what does that have to do with it was a cliche? No, we're saying that even if you were to suggest that there could be a problem, potentially if it's lo noida, we're saying it's not such a problem. It's, it's not. Because it, uh, however you look at it, either the blias is not according to everybody, Hanan, and uh, as far as uh, the other possibility of it becoming Hanan, it doesn't really become Hanan, even if you hold that Hanan is a problem, because it's going to be a cliche by that point. In other words, it's not, either way you look at it, it's not, it should not cause a problem as far as Hanan in the blia, in the spoon. Because we're talking about Hanan only in the blias. So, why make an issue of it over here? It's not, it's, why be machmer on it? With respect yeah. to whether I need skin, yeah. does it make a difference whether I need 60 over again? Right. Not 100. Right. 60. With respect to whether I need 60 again, does it make a difference if I say I need 60 over again because I don't know if all of the milk was extracted from moon, right. or if I say I need 60 over again because some of the milk may have remained, become mixed with that was absorbed in the spoon, yes. and now I have Hanan in the spoon. With respect to, do I need 60 a second time over? Yes. Not, not two times 60. One time 60, we One said that. So we so said it that. made a difference whether I say I'm not sure whether all the milk was extracted this time around, or whether I say Hanan, only if it goes into a pot with chill. No, we always have that chashash that everybody's moide, mask him. That we don't know if all of it was extracted. Exactly. Some and of it perhaps which remained. Which with respect to a, a, of a the milk, flashing, of the milk. Right, which right. is with respect to a flashing top shell, I'll need yeah. 60 again. Right. It's only if I were to stick the spoon now into a, a milk egg top shell, it also needs 60 because of the meat that was absorbed. Even if it didn't become Hanan. Exactly, yeah. So what does it make for it to make whether I assume that it became Hanan? With respect to the requirement of, of, of a 60 over again. I'll need 60 over again either way. Whether I say it's a cliche and it never became Hanan, or there isn't Hanan by Bnei because it's official anyway. Yeah. Regardless, I'll always need 60 over again if I use that spoon without Havala. And it's a That's correct. That's in the Hanami. So, so why these... It won't make a difference. So Hanan will, think... will not make a right. difference so as far as the requirement of the Shishim one. Right. That's why no one even mentions it. I just mentioned that the oh. Derech Agav. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I just mentioned the Derech Agav because it's, you know... Why don't we like... Yeah. Right. Right. There may be sometimes specs fakers, yes. yes. Here we don't have a specs faker per se. We know for sure either there's shishim or there's no shishim. I know, if, but you're right, sometimes when you have an additional suffix, you can make a specs faker out of it. But you don't sure. know how much the bully is worth, and there's no way to make it. Right, but that's, not, that's, not, that's a good question, but that, that does not constitute a suffix. It's a suffix, the idea. Uh, it's not a real suffix in the halacha. Yeah. 
And uh, you know, as far as an important distinction. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, did we ever ask yeah, we spoke about it in Spex Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, it's our problem that we don't know. It's not a problem in, the, in so much in the Metzias, or in the Halacha, I should say. Yeah. Yeah, we have to be machwer, especially if you're talking about a suffix to Raisa. You know, we don't just, you know, it's a bit of a suffix. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, so interesting Chavaz Das over here. So he says, let's apply in Sif Gimel, the second part of Sif Gimel, is the case where you don't have Shishim. Right? So I call Osir. He says, why should everything be Osir if we can apply the reasoning of the Ramah that he was Mekel in Sif Beis? Right? That what? That, you know, you have here, after all, you have here Blias here. You have here Blias that perhaps, you know, it's a cliché by the time you took it out, and it's not Hanan in the Blias. So why don't we apply that reasoning over here? Right? You understand the question? I mean, what, the reasoning that we applied in Sif Beis, that we're not so concerned about a second time, that's because of the, the, the whole idea of saying Hanan or being Machmir on the Blias. It's not such a big deal. The why are we machmir? The gabe de kaf, right? We want to answer. Yeah, I'm ta- I, I think uh, I uh, made a small mistake. It wasn't. It does. We're not necessarily talking about the second half of the sif uh, gimel because then we don't have shishin. I'm talking about even the first part of sif gimel. The first part of sif gimel is uh, the chiddush is you have shishim. And the Tavshu and the Gdera are motor, but the Kaf is also. In that, that's the case. In that case, where the Kaf is the only one that remains also, why don't we apply the reasoning of Sif Beis? Why should the Kaf still remain also? You have Shishim. Especially that you have Shishim. So if you have Shishim in the case of Sif Gimel, then the, everything should be motor, even the Kaf. I thought, I thought it was an interesting question that we should analyze it. So what would you say? What, what would you say is the what would you say is the answer? What would you answer to Chavaz Das? Yeah. What would you say yeah. to the Chavaz Das? So the, what, what Chavaz Das? In other words, yes, the we first do time have six. Second, then we need to be the it. Yeah. Okay. Second time I don't need to. So we say that the Tavshul and the Gdera is motor. The calf remains also because the calf has blias of the two of them. Now, now the calf doesn't remain also. Then the calf now has become also. Before I stuck it in, right. it wasn't also. Right. It was just milky. Right. So with respect to milky, I can't stick it in. Just acquired some meat. So gabe right. milk of course it's also. Right. Gabe like uh, it should be also because uh, I don't know if all of the milky was extracted. There might still be some milky left. It's a benyomo calf. It should be also okay. for both. Yeah. Very good. So the Chavaz Das presents this question. I mean, the horror, we, we could apply the reasoning. It appears that we should be able to apply the reasoning and say that the calf should be also motor here because as far as the Basar, the Basar is Mekushar. You know, it's, it's, it's all connected. And as far as the Hanan, I mean, there's no... Uh, the, 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 you don't even need... You don't, right, exactly. But now your, your question was with respect to reading the calf later, right? Yeah, to reuse it again. Right. Yeah. So I don't understand why it's bigger in the pot with with later. While it's in this tough shell, if yeah. I have. Anyway, so he gives you, he gives you an answer. He says, Ah, yeah. Okay. No, no. His he, approach. I mean, it's not a big question. It's just they saying that in Ochinamid, what we said before in Sif Base that the, the meat that may have been absorbed is still connected by the time you take it out as a cliche. We only said that like with the meat. And the gabbe chanan, right. but the milk is still there, possibly. Right. Yeah. So and even says, if it was an eno ben yomo, right? We, we said by the by the same argument like the gedera, even if it's an yomo, it's atu ben yomo. It's just as atu ben yomo as the gedera is atu ben yomo. Even if the milk had become by now. By the way, I'm saying the kaf, the cholam does become nevela. According yeah. to the ones that hold that, uh, yeah. Well, that's provided you hold that there is bishias. Exactly. Yeah. And uh, and even then, right. it's, uh, even that, it's only a bishul to rabbanan, not bishul to sir. Because the question is, why can't you stick it into cholov? You can stick it into basar. If I mean, no, you can't stick it into, you the can't stick it into the basar poshut, but you can't even stick it into cholov. Why should you be able to stick it into cholov? It's just a exactly. I'm so saying. No, in, in other words, no, but it was shishim. Yeah, but now that you pulled it out, it, there's no longer. There's now meat in the in the in the cup. Yeah. There's no taste of it in no, the, so, the cup. Yeah, so I'm saying, even according, no, that's why he asked, even according to the Svara of the, that we said in Seed Base, that you don't have a problem with the meat, 
you still have a problem, like you were saying, with the chal there. Would you ever not have a problem with the meat once the, from the top? I told you, because maybe it's a cliché. Yeah, but, that, but, it, but it's absorptions of it. The cliché only was on Hanan. The cliché only tells you that, that, that there won't be Hanan because they won't, it's really cliché. Right. But there's absorption of meat in there, regardless of it's a cliché. Who says? Who says? Because that? it was right now in the meat part. Yeah, but there was shishin. Yeah, but it still absorbs. The cow still absorbs okay. meat, even yeah. if there's shishin. Yeah. Yeah. It doesn't absorb meat. Yeah. Let's say I have a pot, and yeah. I have shishim in the pot, and I pour out the food from the pot. The pot does not fly shake, even if there was shishim. Yeah, but remember, what are we saying here? We're saying that the pot did not absorb anything. No, but the cup is like a pot. The pot. The same, yeah, yeah, right, right, right. So the cup is the only one that remains also here. That was, the, that was, his, that was his question. Right, and, and, and it's, not, it's not that the, the cup is also. It's, should, the cup should be printed for vegetable. Is he talking about it's also for vegetables? Yeah, yeah. anyway, his main, no, no. his main point is that even if you say, like we said in Sif Beis, that the Cholov is Mekush, the Basar is Mekushar, and the Basar is not the problem, in other words, the Basar does not become Chana. Even if you say that, right? Yes. But you still have Cholov that became Chanan, Cholov that became an Avela, as a result of absorbing, as a result of not all of it being having come out for sure. So then Some of it still remained before. Some of it still remained in the cup. According to this, yeah. then I would only think against the, 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 the amount of milk that remained in the spoon. Why, why would the why would the chalav yeah. become chalav? from the basar that it was boleya? Yeah, yeah. Wait, 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 yeah. Wait, wait, wait. yeah. If you're telling me that we're that we're going by the opinion that it's cliche by the time you read it, right? So while the spoon's in the meat, the chalav in the spoon, and there was sick in the basar, right? The chalav was completely misbattled because the spoon was attached to the basar. But we, there's always a promise that something perhaps was left behind. Right, before we were right. leaving anything behind. Before yeah. we, while it's still in there, there's nothing left behind. While the, the spoon is still in the Supposedly, top Supposedly, we don't know. Once the spoon is still yeah. in the top shell, the spoon is part of the top shell. Yes. So there you can't speak about no. categorically, there's nothing left behind right now because the spoon... No, is right, not, not at there. that we moment. Don't know. Ah. Was my, we don't no, no, that's no, no, but that's that's right that moment. moment. It's a question is about reinserting it later right, on. So before we reinsert yeah. it, we have to separate. It. We have to take it out. Right. That's when it could become a problem. While right. it's still sticking in, it's for sure no problem. Right. Because it's one thing. The bleas in the spoon and the tufshul in the pot are one chult. So the chalav in the spoon, the taste of chalav in the spoon is connected everything that it's connected to in the pot. Right. And there's no Hanan neither in the meat nor in the chalav. Yeah, but, but you're going in a different direction right now. You're right now, once, yeah, once it's yeah. inserted. Right. Now you're removing it. Right. So once you're now removing it, that's when it could become Hanan. Yes. After removing Right. Mm -hmm. But if you're telling me that there is no Bishul because it's a Lishani, or you're telling me that there, that, that it, that there is no, that there is no, Bishop by Bilius anyway, or you tell me it's a not no Bishop because it's a cliche. In right. either case, neither the meat nor the milk will become Hanan. Or if you tell me the milk could have become Hanan, then the meat would could have become Hanan too. You can't make a distinction in the spoon that was removed from the pot between what happens to the milk and what happens to the meat. Saying that it's a cliche. No, 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 but, but with the meat it was min be mino. We'll see the, 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 that was while it was in the pot, not yeah, removed. Yeah, that's removed. So if it's removed, it could be a cliche. But the cholov, the cholov is enomi. The cholov did become Hanan. When? The first time around. When it was in the top shell? When it was in the top shell, yeah. Why? That's the way he holds. How can it become a Hanan when it's in the top shell? He holds, that's what he holds, because it could be that something will still remain, something was still but there. It, Even was when it there. was inside. But everything was in there while it was inside. Yeah, yeah. But, uh, yeah. If you're going to say yeah. that, if you... That's what he says, that's, that's it what he says. Right. Yeah. Go ahead. Yeah. Why would you have and there's a potential to... And that's the problem. You don't know. Let him, let him. Yeah. You don't know at yeah, which point yeah. which is occurring, the other or both. And that's why you have the potential. It doesn't do anything for the top. Not yeah, while the spoon is in the top, so it's yeah. one unit. Yeah. Then, that instantaneous break, the top shell remains the way it was, if there was more than 60. Right. And the cup is now a cliche. That's correct, so, yeah. Yeah, that's I don't understand. That's why I don't understand. No, no, so. Oh, he's explaining to what, what, what I just said. Yeah. While it was in the cle. Yeah. I mean, that's where I think we differ. When right. it was in the cle, this, whatever bleus is in a spoon and whatever food is in is one you. You don't have two distinct. You spill milk into a chulant pot with meat and 
You're not going to tell me that whatever drops of milk are in that pot have a separate thing from whatever the meat has. If yeah. there's 60 in the pot, everything in that pot anyway, is misbottled. Let, let me explain the Rubikiva Eger on this, and then perhaps you'll understand, by reverse, you'll understand the Chavaz Das. Reverse psychology. Yeah. <laughs> Rabbi Kiva Eger in his Agos and the Chavaz Das says like this, the Ramah in applying the reasoning of being Samech on the two Tamim, the only reason he said that in Sif Beis is because you're dealing with the Durabanan there, of Min Bemima, the Basar and the Basar, which is really this battle Beroiv. So it's the whole issue there is the Durabanan. That is the only case where the Ramah said, fine, I can see that, that's Rabbi Kiva Eger explaining, that he would be Mekel over there. With respect to what was the Ramah Mekel over there? Legabe the Basar. With respect to what? That you need only yeah. 160 and not 260? That's correct. But we're not talking here about 120. Yeah. Wait a minute. No, no. We're, but talking, about, we're it, talking about Lechatchila to reinsert it. But we're talking why about does it, but why does that the Ramah, calf is a surah. The calf is a surah because of the blias of the two. Why does the yeah. Ramah over there right. require C the second time you only because if you still may have Cholab. Not only the Ramah, everybody does. Right. Everybody does. Right. So That's all. here it wouldn't be different? No, but here, if you, it would be different if you say that there's Basar Becholov here, or there's just Cholov there. What? What? It's also Behano. It would only make a difference with respect to, it would only make a difference with respect to, what do we call it, uh, vegetable. Okay, that's good enough. That's what we're talking about. I'm talking about that it would make a difference. We're not just talking about to Basar or Cholov, because then it, it may not make a difference. It could make a difference if you have Blias of Basar Becholov together. Agav, even though right. by vegetables, right. it should be if they're hot. Because then you're cooking the bleas right now. We're going to talk about that next, about cooking this. Yeah. So anyway, Shubha Kibega says that that Ramo is only in a Darabana. He was makele to use do, that reasoning, those two heterim, those two tamim. But not whenever there's a chashash doraisa. He was not makele. And here he says the calf, this calf, let me see if I have it here. So what's the doraisa Putting, taking this calf now and putting it into other kalim, into, in other words, reinserting it other, everywhere else, would be a situation of Amin B'Sha'in Aminoi. I don't have here the whole thing. Ah, because it's Hanan and it's going to be something that's not Hanan? No, 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 it would be if going into Ein Aminoi. It would be an Ein Aminoi situation. Bajika, and that makes it a Dorisa rather than a Dorabana. Exactly. It's Minu B'Minoi, so that yeah. it would be... There's a Hashash of Anisu Dorisa. Yeah. So right. here, but it's mean but ain't no mean you need to end the rice. In this case, in this particular case. And right. so what? No, and therefore the Ramo would not be makel over here on the calf. Okay, in other words, here what we were trying to say, the Chavaz Das was saying, let's be makel on the calf too, in the same way we're makel. Even though it's not exactly the same situation, over there we're makel because of the second time you insert it into the pot. Here we're not dealing with that question. We're not dealing with the same scenario of reinserting it twice. But we're trying to apply the reasoning of why over there it's not a problem more than once. Well, if it's not a problem more than once, then why should the calf here become also? Over there it's not a problem more than once, that means. It's not a problem more than once that you need two times 60. But the second time over you need 60 yeah, Of course, again. you always need 60. Because there still may be some so make left over. So you also need 60? You would need 60, and just against the Cholov. So, here, here we're talking about... That the it's a calf also benim basur benim cholov the fish he blew me basur becholov. But filu bedi eved oiseres im chazuk tachbu ben basur becholov. That's the where the the, the the question is. Why should it be even bedi eved oiseres? Why should the calf remain also if you if you use the same reasoning that you use in seed base? So here it would be more of a question of min beinoi minoi, right? To reinsert this cholov that may have remained behind in the calf again in basur. That would be the problem. That would be the difference. That's the way Rabbi Kibayger explains it. All right. I, I thought it was just it would just be an additional because it appears a little bit difficult to understand. You know, why should the calf be usher with with either of the two of them? If you say that the bli is perhaps there's no Hanan, or you say that by the time you take it out it's a cliche, you know, what what could be a problem over here? Well, I mean, we don't have such a problem in Sif Aleph as a result of that. In other words, we're lenient. The Ramos says one times sixty is enough. So Rabbi Kivegers, I think his explanation fits in a little bit better here. There are, I, I agree with you with, with the Chavaz Das's own explanation is that the, the Chal of remains Hanan and not the Basar. Okay, so you can tie in why should the Chal of be more Hanan than the Basar. Even so, there's still, for sure, there's a Hashash that some Chal of remain behind. And that is why we say the Chal of becomes Hanan. 
even though the, one the buser is kosher to the other buser. But I think Rabbi Kibbe Eger's Hesber is a little bit a little bit stronger, in that uh, this is more of a isra chashash of an isra doraisa to put it back in. So in that kind of a situation, we're not going to be makel with these additional tani. All right. Anyway, the shach adds over here that according to the Rama, even if you went ahead and inserted this kaf in a fleshik apart, that there's no shishim. In other words, even though you put it into a pot that is a fleshic pot, there's no meat inside. As we spoke about it last time, the Ramo will be marking. This is really belongs more to Sif Hay. The Poiskim asked a question on the shop. Why does it mention over here? This really has nothing to do with it, but it's a, it's, it's a point that he wants us to know, I guess. That even if this pot did not have meat, but it was a fleshic pot and there was no shishim, it would be a problem. The calf would become ulcer. In other words, you, she went ahead, you, you, the balabusta went ahead and used a spoon to mix the content of a pot, whether it was hot water or vegetables. It's a fleshy pot, it's a melting spoon. It, everything, it's, we're talking about binyarma, of course. The calf will be ulcer. But there's no meat in there. Still, the ramo is mocked. But this we'll see a little bit more in see if, hey. All right, let's go on a little bit. Interesting. Yeah. Here he brings that the Chavaz does, and the Mosadam, right. well, the Chavaz does, and 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 the Chavaz does, the question that we raised in the past. The Mechaber says, Im ain't sh- uh, Okay, that's actually Sif Dalat. So let's learn Sif Dalat first inside, and we'll come back to Sif Dalat. Im ain't a kaf ben yoyma, Sif Dalat that says, If the kaf is not ben yoyma, akdeir of a tav shal mutorm, the kaf osor. Oh! The whole question here is on Yerakor. That's the Ikra question, of course. Because it's basu becholam. But anyway, in Sif Dalat, the kaf will also be Osir, even if the kaf was not being Yoimoy. There in Tafshul is motor, it's not being but the kaf is also, why? Kaf also the Chathilo ben in Basu ben in Cholov, and we come back up with the Ebed, ain't no sales given Shaloisa bis Yano. But the Ebed does not answer since it was not being Yoimoy. Yeah? He brings you exactly. Yeah. Because yeah. now that the two Bugliyas come out of the Spudiyah, of course, now they become Hanan. Well, sure, that's the problem. You're, t- you're having two blias in whatever it is that you're cooking. No, in the Yerakot. In Basel Bechal, they can't do it. In Basel Bechal, you have no question, because you can't put it in the Either one. Have... Right. It, it may have a blia of, each, of either one. Of either one. Right. But by Yerakot, the question is why it's Aser. In Bidiyabad, why it's Aser. And there he gives the answer, because even bring all of the actions why there is no Hanan in, in the spoon. In the spoon, yeah. Once the two tastes come out and go into the... Vegetables. Yeah. In the vegetables, it's combined and become hanan in the. It's an enomino. You mean the, where he says enomino? No, no, no. He, he says the yeah. taste of the milk and the taste of the meat will right. come out of the spoon. In the spoon, they're not hanan. Right. And now that they're in the yurakos, there they make yeah. them hanan. That's a separate thing. Yeah, but that's not very Rikiva eager. That's just a separate issue of. Uh, of having the two blias come out into a, other food. Right. That it would be also. Yeah, it would still be also. We still have the question of the Chavaz Das even without that. On which the Rebbe Vega says that in this case, you would be running into a Chashash de Raisa, Veino Minoy, which is a little bit different than that case of Yerokas, which is also true. Once something has blias of Basa Bacholov and it's Ben Yoyma, the Mechaber says, Afilu Bedi Evedoy Seres, even though he says a few of the David says in Khazur Betokhu Bim Bebosu Bim Becholov, by Yerokas it would be too, but it's not exactly the same. With Yerokas, I can see that not everybody would agree, depending on that. Well, at least with the Rabbanet, maybe also, not with the Raisa. But we'll talk about that later. later. The yeah, but what his example is if you're cooking vegetables and you have, and you have a spoon that has bleas of both Basur Becholov. If you start ben, ben Yoyma, so it's, there's no time of Gam. Mm-hmm. Right? Right. 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 You're still going to have the Kibbeire into whatever you're cooking into that. Yeah, but that's going to be not by not. I see that in CK. That's not by not meaning because by the time it, it, it exits the vessel, the, 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 it goes into the water, then goes into the vegetables, it's a second generation Tom. 
No, no, but but no. But what happens when it's out of this into the water before it goes into the walls? Right. It now became Hanan. The water became Hanan, yeah, right. If, if this, but in your case, yes. In your case, yeah, because you're talking about the spoon having already a Hanan Bli. No, 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 not having already. already. Having Bli as a boss of a Cholov. No, a boss and Cholov. Right. Without having become Hanan yet. Spoon is water. All right, yeah. Just plain water. Right. One vein yellow. Sure. And the pot is only one. Right. The water, the water in the pot is going to be hot. If you have this, uh, the spoon. No, it will not. Why wouldn't water become a hanan? Well, that's because of not by not. Not by not is a concept that when you have. That's a, that's a first. The vegetable is the same, but the water in the pot is only. Here's the question. Yes, we will see. We will see. According to some, that's what the the more is more mark than that. Yeah, according to the some, it would be a problem. Exactly. Not the mechaber. The mechaber is more mekel and not what not by not means. The not by not itself concept, there's differences of opinion on how to interpret that. Mm -hmm. If it's just to the water, to the water, to the vegetables, how many times you need it. It's not like food going to food. In the case of the pot going to the water, it's less stringent. He, he, he summarizes the way he says, Yes. Right, that's the one. Right. 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 Sure. Right. That's what we said. Yeah. In our case, it would be a chashash d'oraisa. I mean, bevein o minoy. The chalov left over with with basar. But that's not necessarily the example of yerakos. That's an additional. Here he's talking only about yerakos. Only about yerakos. Only about yerakos. On the, on, it was even, no, what he may be saying is even in your rockers. No, no, on the Basar yeah. and the Chalaf, he said, irrespective of all, all right. this consideration, there it's clear that it's Asar because you have Basar yeah. Balua and you have Chalaf Balua, so you can't right. use it in either case. But why your rockers? And now on your rockers, he brings all this pulpul that you just. On your rockers, he brings Dafka. it. Dafka. Yeah, okay, it could be that even uh, what he's saying. The, what he's saying is, e base, but he's saying Ramah, even on your rockers, maybe even, even on your rockers. Okay, yeah. Because no, on the other things, you wouldn't have, the, you wouldn't even have the question to ask why should you be machmer? Because there, since you have, oh, uh, I see what you're saying. I see what you're saying. Yeah, that we said machmer. that. You're right. In Okinawa, you wouldn't like, even have the question. Now All you right. have the question. In Okinawa, yeah. Now you have more of a question. What lechatchila? To do it lechatchila? Or with the other? Okay, of course. What I was saying, and what I was saying that. In other words, okay, yeah, you're right. It more, it's more applicable to this situation because otherwise you There's would... No, of course you can't. Of course you shouldn't use a lechatkila, but okay. And yeah. of course the last are going to be the Because you have... You yeah, have, of course. Much, yeah, of course. Of course. You have, yeah, but the, but the question really, the question is a, is, a, is a question in itself. Even what out of example of you. I mean, why can't you apply that reasoning here? All right. All right. Because he doesn't remember the Machabah doesn't bring the case of Yerakos. So that's why the question of the Chavazas is not Yerakos. Per well, se, it's just in, in, in principle, why should the Kaf remain also to, uh, in itself? Okay. Right. Uh -huh. So it seems that what the Chabbos does here is, is going on, and the Chokmas Adam as well, yeah. that this is a Yavad, what they're specializing on is even in Yerakos. Even in Yerakos. That that's be, what they want to explain. That would be the Chiddush. Yeah, okay. Yeah. All right, the Beishesu asked a good question, that in the case of Seif Dalad, where we said that if the Kaf is not being known with the Dekterian Tav Shalom Motor, the Kaf still remains also because it, whether we bust or hollow, because it has bleeders of the two, but the Yemen, if you put it in by mistake again, of course it's not by Sarah's, since it's not being so basically Yosef asks, why do we say there and Tafshil are motor? Just because the calf is not being remote. And the calf is also, once again, a similar question about the calf. The calf is not being remote. So why should the calf be also now to use it? And the there and Tafshil are motor. The situation is Aina Ben Yemur. You you follow the question? Here we're talking about Aina Ben Yemur. So kafir also will be motor. Says so the answer is very simple. There is a big difference chiluk between the eno ben yomo of the kaf and the eno ben yomo that is in this pot right now. What's being cooked right now, to begin with, is something eno ben yomo, right? The milk that is being put into this pot is an eno ben yomo type of milk. It's a pogum milk, pogum tam. 
So therefore, the top shell, uh, the gdera are mutar. But the calf, you started off with fresh milk, not eno ben milk in the calf. You started off with fresh milk. This is a milk like a spoon. And my the spoon became pogum after 24 hours. So the calf is going to be usher if it if it absorbed uh, meat. You follow me? In other words, that the calf originally has a, an iser, and it was an iser in relation to the basar. Cholov is also for basar, right? So the cholov in the spoon is not a pogum cholov to begin with. It's real cholov. It just, it became later on pogum as a result of a time, a lapse of time. That, you don't say, should become mutter. All of a sudden it should be mutter. No, it was also to begin with. It just happens to be you're lucky that that spoon was used after a certain amount of time elapsed. But you started off with real cholov. It's, it's a milichik spoon. Here the pot is not at fault. The pot received a tam pogum into it. So, you, so you're not going to ask the ever the tafshil or the pot. Why should you? It's, it's tam pogum. But the, but the spoon, you started off with a milchik spoon. You started off with the wrong kind of spoon to be used for this pot. And am I, you're lucky that the spoon is it's past 24 hours. That we don't say that you, that kind of a spoon is not going to be water. That kind of a spoon is going to remain answered because of the two bleas that it has. Lechatila. That's just a question that he raises in us. What's the difference between <laughs> this is not pogum, this is pogum, and this is pogum. <laughs> Why this motor and this not? Well, oh, the calf is not, it, it's pogum only because of time that elapsed. It started off with a real milk of the spoon. <laughs> what do you want? You can't use it now. The buster, the tafshu, the kdera, they received a tam pogum. They were never, they were always okay. They never had anything wrong with them. Tosis brings a similar to Terra's explanation for this. Real quickly, the Taz here on the last Eve brings, and we mentioned this one too, he brings the Torah's Chathas that even though the, in Sif Gimel that is, something may be also Behano because the Pat has the Bliyas of the two, Boso Becholov, Benei Yoimon. Nevertheless, you may be able, according to some, you may be able, Rashal is Choylek on this. But he says, apparently, it's mutter to cook hot water to use it for bathing. Khafifa Saroy, she says, because you're not having a direct Hano from the Basu Becholov. So, now this task brings down the Torah's Chathas. The Rashal is Choylek. The crazy place, he says, it's very interesting on this. I saw the crazy place, he says, on this example of water, he says, but wait a minute, you can't do that. You're cooking Basu Becholov. You're taking water and you're boiling it in a pot? Forget about that now. I <laughs> know. He says, you're cooking basal bacholov. So I, I saw someone, I forget who, explain that maybe it's a primigodim. No, no, primigodim is something else. Primigodim says something else. That's something like what you were saying before. There is an explanation that perhaps the Ramah, or the Torah's Chathas, the, the Taz, they would hold there's no basal bacholov. Um, there's no bishlach or bishlach and basal bacholov. Ah, so that, that's the point. Whether they were mispashal together or not. Yeah. Each was mispashal separately. Right, 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 right. So, but the prima god, and, the, the and there is a prima god that holds that uh, there is no basal bechol of the oraisa bishul by blias, mm-hmm. by taruvas of tam, I should say. Tam, he says, it's not blias. We, 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 we raised that issue before. It has to be more. Tam, if the tam. Mm-hmm. It would have to be real basal, real cholo. Mm-hmm. Do Is there an iser? That, that was a question you actually raised. Mm-hmm. Is there an iser of cooking? And we said yes, posh, but it's not also posh because the Premier Godin says not necessarily. There would not be Bishop Basel Bechalov, the Raisa, in Tamim, just Tam, cooking the two together. That's an interesting point, too. So, uh, so in other words, if you had if a so maybe, that was cooked in a, in a milk pot and you cook these two potatoes together, exactly. they were still half raw. Right, yeah. That's a good, yeah. That would be a good example of it. Would that be a Bishop? Also, Becholov. Rabbi Gaon says, not the Raisa. So, so it could be that the Taz, the Torah's Chathas, they hold that the reason why you can cook that water in the pot is because that's not, that's not constant. So, the, you know, it was crazy. You place had a good question. Forget about now deriving Hano. Here it's Basel Becholov you're cooking again. No, no, no. Either you say there's no Bishul Achar Bishul, right? Or, I mean, there's no, which is similar to the other explanation. It's not really, there's no Bishul in the Tamim. There's no real Bishul Basel Becholov in the Tamim. Or I guess, I guess there, I mean, they are different. One says there's no bishul achar bishul, right? Because it was already cooked. This one is saying more that there's no bishul to begin with. Well, with both tamim. of them are, are finding a, 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 a 
problem, both of them are attacking the idea going on. Yes, yeah, yeah. It's a, it's a good the creation place is a good question here. Uh, but I kind of issue of the Torah also. Yes, yeah, exactly. Real quickly, we, we left off with uh, something that we were going to cover today, so I'll go over. This is a, there's a shach, Sif Kotin Yud, if you're ever interested, in Tzadik Dalet here, who, who's, you can see from this shach that he's Cholik on the Bach. What are we talking about in this shach? This concerns Sif Gimel. Going back to Sif Gimel. Okay, this is the example. You had Melchik spoon inserted into flesh, into meat. And then you went ahead again and inserted again within 24 hours of the meat, again to meat. But by the time you inserted it again a second time into meat, it was already beyond the 24 hours of the cholov. So you had cholov, yeah. spoon, into meat, it became asa. Then you went ahead and stuck it into meat, again, again not cholov, into meat, 24 hours. within 24 hours of the meat. But it's beyond the 24 hours of the cholov. The Bach says it's okay. Why? This is all he says. Because the Cholov that's there is already Pogu. And the Shach says, no, it's also. Come on. But then it would be the same thing if you stuck it into... Uh, if, you say, if, if, if the Isra is not the milk. If the Isra is now when you, put, when you cook the milk with the, with the meat the first time around, no, a new Metzias was created called Hana. Yeah. And this Metzias that was created now was absorbed during the second cooking and not during the cooking of the milk. No, 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 so what happened with the milk, whether it's Pagum or not Pagum by now, it doesn't interest me because what's asering the food now is the Hanan. This is the 24 hours of this Hanan. Yeah. Then I understand that he says that, but then it would also apply for to both and not only for but if it's only going to, if it's going to apply dafka for me, then he's relying on the challah. And if he's relying on the challah, the taste of challah, the taste of the meat can't answer the, the meat taste of the challah. Yeah. But if that taste of challah, which is answering here, is the ten time the God, why would it be answer? Yeah. Anyway, it could be, sorry for what you're saying, but here the shach is concerned more about the basar. So he says like this. I guess it's because he's relating to this example of the Allah here. Alright. So you understood the Machlekes? Yeah, yeah. No, no, here it's a different problem. Here. It's a boss of a hall of kale, mm -hmm. right? Because the milk and the meat met each other neyoyman. You can't use it for meat or milk, or really for anything, really, because it's, it's hanan. It's a real hanan. And if you did, it answers the uh, new food, but the avid, I'm sorry, like, it's, it, it, you know, with the avid, if it happens, it answers if, it's, if they're neyoyman, right? Because you're not, because you're not allowed to have enough of bon boss of a hall of. Okay? Now, in, 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 in the example where the Bach and Shachar Choylek, you have a situation where there's meat, and there's meat again. That's the example, because that's it's really the example of the Halacha, of the Mechaber. So the Bach says, so since the Cholov, by this time, the second time around, is already Pogum, you're okay, but the Eved. Everybody's but the Eved. And the Shach says no. So I just wanted to bring this uh, this case, because I saw two very good explanations as to what the Machloikis could be. This is basically the, from the Prima Godim I took. Prima Godim, by the way, on, on this halacha says we pass in like the Shach, even perhaps in Meruba. Mm -hmm. In the Prichodosh, the Chokhmah. So the only one who passes like the Bach that I say is the Chavaz Das, actually. <laughs> Interesting. But the, the Prima Godim says we pass in like the Shach, even perhaps in Meruba. Okay, so this is what the Prima Godim, this is how the Prima Godim explains this Machloikis. I thought it was very nice the way he put it together. It's good to discuss it to see how the, the two opinions diverge, two different kinds of thinking, two different approaches. One approach as to why the Bach and Shach have this machloikis is because of another machloikis Shach and Taz and Simen. If you remember in Simen Kuf Hay, we spoke about pieces, a piece of meat next to another piece of meat. Now, this piece of meat is, has cholov absorbed into it. It's a bus of a cholov kind of meat. And it's touching another piece of meat. And forget about shuman, forget about fatty meats. So the halacha over there was, we learned in the halacha that the Belias cannot travel 
from one piece of meat to another piece of meat unless there's liquid to make it travel. Hot food with hot food, butter with butter, yes. One is straight, one is kosher, yeah, you can have it. You have a kadena tila, you can have all kinds of things like that, a little bit. But if this butter is also because of blias, the blia cannot travel to the next meat next door and taste it through it unless you have liquid. That was the, that's, that was the issue in Kufay, if you remember. Comes along the shach and says, but that's not true if it's basar b'cholov. If this is not just a blia, an ordinary blia of chalev, this basar is basar b'cholov. So the whole thing is a shtikel chanan. So it's, you don't need the milk to travel to the next piece of meat. All you need is a piece of the flavor of the basar that is chanan to travel next. And it does. And the Taz says no. The Taz says no, that the din of blia not traveling next to the next piece of meat without liquid is even with basar b'cholov. So even though this piece of meat is a chanan, but it's a, why is it a chanan? Because it has a blia of cholov. And that cholov technically cannot travel to the next piece of meat. So they're next to each other, they're very hot, it will not travel, not go anywhere. So what, what do we learn? The Primagod says, from that, you, you learn the big machlok, you saw the machlok between the shach and the taz, and if technically you could ever separate basar b'cholov, would they become again mutar? They were once together, they were asr. You pull them apart somehow, would they become mutar? Based on that, taz, he says they should be able to. So, so the Taz would say, a Shalosofto is mutar? And the, well, not really. They're not the halacha of the Shalosofto, but the Basar B'cholov, technically, if you would be able to separate them, because Basar B'cholov, is it, is it that they become also because they are together, but if they're separate, they're no longer also? Or are we saying Basar B'cholov, as soon as they come together, they're inseparable. They have become a new Metzius of Basar B'cholov, is so Hanan. Right. And that's what the Shach says. When we say Hanan, Basar B'cholov, we mean that. They come together, they're inseparable, even if you are able to separate, they become, you become, you, it's a new answer here. If you and separated them, you, you would have a milky form of Hanan and, and a basar form of Hanan. For exactly, and the, the Taz, and the, and the Premier Godin points out that the Taz would be saying no, that the idea of Hanan is so long as they're together. But if you somehow are able to separate them, they would no longer be Hanan. And, the, and that's how the Premier Godin learns shot in the Taz, from there, he says, you see, from that Taz, that he holds that they're basically two separate things. Together, they're a problem, but they're, if they're separate, because the busser is it, the busser's time, the, the busser does not is not a problem here. If the cholov can't travel, the busser does not present a problem. So anyway, so the shach, so the premier Godam explains, that's one thing that's going on over here between the bach and the shach, but that's not all. He says there's another machloek is a noisim tamlut gam. This noisim tamlut gam means that the reason why it's mutter because it's now like dust like dirt, or does it mean that it's just not Lishvach anymore? Is it like dust, it's like nothing, it's no tam? Or Nois and of Gam means, you know why it's mutter? Because it's no longer tasty. This machloit is a machloit is in Hilchah's Pesach too, by Chometz, if Nois and Tam of Gam. What's the real, what do I say? Is it non-existent? The tam is not there, it's not there. I mean, it's pogum, it's non-existent. Or it's just not Lishvach. If it's not Lishvach, you know, then we would be Machmer. But if you say it's all four, it's garnished. So the Premier Godin says, you have here a combination of these two ideas here going on between the Bach and the Shah. The Bach says, you're able to separate the two. The two are really separable. By the time 24 hours have elapsed from the first Tam of the Cholov, the Cholov is already, that which has been separate, right, is already off for it. It's already nothing. So it is non-existent. That there's no Cholov there. So he's, it's a combination of the two Tamim. He says, you can separate them perhaps, and here, once you separate, there's nothing, and there's nothing left there. It's because it's after 24 hours. It's, so this, why should it be also? Well, whereas the shach would hold, they're not exactly separable. That's why he holds it in, in taruvas. And besides that, who says that, it, that, that, that it's pogrom exactly? I mean, pogrom means becoming effort. You know, it, it could be it's just not lishvach. I mean, it's a combination of the two ideas, the Premier Godem says, that seems to be behind the machloikas of the shach and taz. All right. I thought that was very, very interesting in how he presents it. The, Paz, the, Taz would, the Bach would hold like the Taz, or the Taz would hold like the Bach. But if they would separate it, they would be okay. You know, Yisim Tamil Gan would mean that it's like dirt. So therefore, you have nothing left of the milk. All right. But wait a second. So does that mean that would allow you to eat that meat? Yes, that's what he's saying. Now, do, regardless of yes, what that's what he's saying. he's saying. I have the meat in front of me. Yes, that's twenty hours have twenty-four hours have passed since the milk since was the milk was bought. Right, the meat is still a tasty piece. Yes, 
so I can go ahead and now eat it. it According to the Bach, yes, mm-hmm. yes. You can separate. No, no, no. no, no the taste no, no. inside is no centam of no, There's no centam of gram. Remember, the, the second time around, you stuck it into meat pot, and it's beyond 24 hours of the original milk. No, 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 no. And now it is. Now that I'm going to eat it. When you cooked the meat in the pot, it was within the 24 hours. I'm talking hours. about the second time. The second meat. No, I'm not talking about the second You're not time. talking about the second no, no, meat? listen to what I'm saying. You have a pot. Right. You cooked milk in this pot four hours ago. Right. Now you cook meat in this pot. You have halal. Okay, fine. 21 hours later, the meat isn't 24 hours yet, but the milk is already 25 hours. I can sit down, take the meat, put eat it. No. Because no. the milk inside is not ten times lifkam. No. It's no. no longer Hanan. No, no, no. no, no. When, but, what, no, no. Was... when they were together, they became Hanan. Right, according to this opinion. Right. If, 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 if it's still Hanan now, it falls no, into no, another no, no. part of the, the same example, thing. The it's example of the, 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 example of the Bach and Shach is that you took that spoon that has Hanan. It's treif. Yeah. Okay? And you put it in later on, again, into Basar, but yes. that second time around, yes. it was beyond the 24 hours of the Cholov. That's exactly my point. So I can eat it. That's what the Bach says you can. No, but, no, no, I can eat this meat. That was but not in, in your pot. case. In your case, yeah. the pot, your case is the first example, not a second example. The first example is cholov no, and basar. The, the same argument that prevents the, the, the spoon from assuring the second tafshil, oh. according yeah, but, to the yeah, bath. No, your example is they become asur. They can't become, stop being asur. So then, the, so then the spoon cannot stop assuring something. No, 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 no. But that's what he says it does. So according to that opinion, I should be able to eat no, the meat. No, no, no. The difference here when you no. do urine milk, four hours late meat. So you have a real answer. Five hours late. At that four hour mark, the meat, it yeah. became not. Right. It's not 24 hours. Yeah, yeah. In your case... Uh, this is a different case with yeah. the spoon. You're, where it's, you're confused two sides. Uh, Ilan, in your example, once you have something trafe, it doesn't cease to become trafe. Then that the piece of meat. in the spoon should not cease to become trafe either. What? That no, it does. So if it does, then I should be able to eat. It. No, because legabe itself, legabe itself, it's trafe. So then, so then yeah, the, the, the Bach and the Shach are not talking about legabe themselves. If, if legabe itself is yeah, trafe, right? Then it should usher whatever it ushers. The milk cannot. Fulfill, that's what the that's what the shark the, says. The, yeah. the, the, the milk cannot yeah. usher the meat that is inside, right. and yet not usher the meat that's outside because the gabe. That's the new that's meat, out. but that's new meat. The, the second meat is time very around. new, but the gabe, But if the argument that the milk cannot usher that new meat is because the milk is in the ten tam the gum, right? And you can separate the two, like uh, according to the Bach. Then, according then, with respect to the meat itself, nobody says that. The meat itself, yeah. You should, the, the, yeah. The, 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 how do you ask the first? Meat? The first meat is inseparable. Well, how can you tell me it's, uh, simultaneously the meat is inseparable and it is separable? That's the that's why the Shach disagrees that's, that's, with it. That's, that's, the Shach says because the Shach says it's not separable. The Bach says it is separable. Yes. I can separate the first. Okay, separate the cholov by the time the second buser comes around. The second buser comes, I can yeah. separate them. I yeah, can well, actually separate if, the time frame. But you're telling me that the yeah. second buser is not becoming usher because of the of the taste of Hanan, right? Of the taste of Hanan, right? Which is the taste of the meat, which is a Hanan meat, right? But it's be, but the only thing that could usher it would be the taste of the milk, which right. is not the time of gum. Then that same meat that is not ten times come in the new buster should cease ushering the meat that it was ushering while it was not the ten times. Yeah, come. but obviously that's you're dealing with you're, you're looking at it as a separate entity. It's a separate entity. That's what the, so that's if it's the a box. separate entity. As soon as it is not ten times come, the meat that is ushered before. Yeah, but in your case, no, there's no argument. Apparently, in your case, that they once they become, they're together, they're married forever. <laughs> they might be married, but yeah. it's not ten times of come now. Yeah, it doesn't make what, a difference. So you? then, the yeah. taste of a piece of meat that is hana. Yeah should answer the other meat, forget the taste of the milk. Yeah, it doesn't apparently according to the Bach. That's the so, Bach's Chiddush. So that's the whole point. That's so the big Bach like here. But, but, yeah. but, but based on that Chiddush of the Bach, I should be able to the meat. Yeah, and in the first case, nobody argues that it's Asr, because it became Treif, the two of them got together, and they're inseparable. If they're inseparable, they, then the Bach... Unless, the unless you find a way to separate them. So, so then the Bach... Unless, remember the Taz? No, Unless no, no, no. you find out where to no, separate. No, no, no. Them. So then the boss position doesn't work. They're, t- they're together. They're together and they stay together. So if they're together, yeah. then the taste of the meat, which is a, a this taste of meat that became us. No, 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 no. But you're forgetting a point, Ilan. You're yes. forgetting a point we just said before with the base Yosef. Okay? Once something becomes usser, 
even though later on it becomes pogrom, at one point, at one point it was Asr. Wasn't it? Yes. In the second example, at the very start, it's not Asr, according to the Bach. It's never becoming Asr. You, you, you tell, you're taking Chalav, which is pogrom, to begin with and applying it to meat. Okay? In the first case, of you have Basar the Chalav. You're not getting my point. Yeah. Because in the second case, besides the Chalav, yeah. that is now pogrom, that you're applying to meat. Yeah. The taste of the meat which has absorbed, the first meat that has absorbed, that became Asr, yeah. is also affecting that meat. You have min beminoi. You have a tray for piece of meat yeah. that is being cooked with a kosher piece of meat. Yes, it's not the taste of halav, it's the taste of yeah. meat. Well, but once that meat became asr as hanan, yeah. Yeah, well, that's the of then, the, it, then, yeah. that, then the, not the taste of the, the milk. Hada, the, it's not the enough. The taste of the meat of should the asr. That's, that's, so if he's claiming right. that the taste of the meat does not asr, the, taste, to be the taste of the hanan does not ask. Of the meat. Exactly. Of the, of the, of the meat, of the meat. Of, of the, the in the not meat. The halav in the meat. He doesn't say that. So, but if you're doing... He separates them. He holds so it. So if you're separate. separating it, I can eat it. No, you can't. Because you, can't can't. Say, you can't tell me that the, 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 <laughs> the, the, the taste of the meat that yeah. I can't eat will not ask something. But I told you what. The difference is that in your case, the basar and the halav in the, within a few hours, four hours of each other, they have become trade. You're forcing the me very to, first time. You're forcing me to repeat myself, and that trade a piece of meat right. that is trade right now right. is ushering that other meat. Forget the milk. The milk is not yeah, but that's the meat. The but, the meat, but the meat that was yeah. trade. Well, if it's not, if, it, if if I can't eat it, it ushers the meat, and if it yeah. doesn't usher the meat, I can eat it. No, it's that's that's the whole thing. Remember, that was what we said in Taruvas that the milk and meat, according to the Taz, appear to be two separate things. They just happen to be together to, in, in one place, and that's why they're ushered. When they're together, if you are real, if you look at them as separate things, then the time of the Hanan does not ask it the way you would think it would. Then I can eat it because the, the, the only thing, the yeah. only because yeah. they, because because now I'm te- te- dealing with meat that's not asr. Yeah, no, but the first meat became asr once. How could you stop me? How uh, could I'll you? tell you because as the everybody mechaber, agrees. I'll tell you because yeah. as the mechaber yeah. said, as right. the mechaber said, if a piece of meat was bolea iser like chaylev, right, and fell into another pot. Yeah. That has 60 against the chaylev, the piece of meat itself becomes mutter. Remember we learned that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. In, yeah, yeah, in, yeah. In yeah. Anyway, the, the point is that. The, Remember we learned yeah, that in yeah, Basar yeah, yeah. yeah, that's a separate thing. Here, we're talking about something becoming also. That was the. That well, was there what the also basis. the meat became also because of an yeah. Isabalua. The basis of says once something becomes also. It doesn't cease to become us. But that's not what he said yeah. in, in, in yeah. the few so on before. Yeah. Yeah. He told us that the meat absorbed chaylev and fell into a pot with meat. Right, that's something. And else. that was 60. The meat itself becomes mutter. Wh- that was the whole thing that well, it talked about. Says, says, uh, the wise empiric says like this. You're talking about Efshel Asayfta? Here we said we yeah. had a piece of meat that right. absorbed chaylev. The Mechaber brought right. this the example. I think in Sadiq Days. Yeah. A piece of meat that, that absorbed chaylev right. and fell into another, where he makes the difference, the distinction. He says, whereas in Basab Chalav we have Hanan, but if the meat absorbed chaylev and not chalav, right. and fell into a second pot right. where, there, where, where, where there was 60 against the chaylev yeah. that was absorbed, right. then the meat itself becomes mutter. Yeah, but remember, he, 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 he says... Well, somewhere else he says something he says, so, we, so there was... Why do I have to go over there? No, no, no. Why do, you, we had, we remember, we spoke about that. Why does the Mechaber yes. appear to be soy to himself? Yes. Between the two so, there are, so there are different... Yes. No, no, that's a different question of Efshel Asayich It has nothing to do with this. Did you were talking about Once something, too? Not really. It's a little bit different angle. With the, either you look at them separately or you're looking at them together. Once something be- becomes Asr, it doesn't cease to be Asr. But what is Efshel, as far as Hanan is concerned. What is Efshel Asayich yeah. yeah. What is Efshel Asayich is only a question in the, in the physics. Uh, did something still remain behind? But that's the whole. No, no, yeah. no, no. Actually, yeah. the is a deen that yeah. is explained with physics. Yeah, exactly. This is but, this, but, uh, this but, Hanan has nothing to do with physics. Of course, the, the, you're telling yeah. me the milk became pogum. It's not anything to do with physics. According to some, even, oh, if, there's, the even if there's oh. chemistry, yes. Even if there's no milk left, it's still Hanan. According to some most sheets, even if there's not, not left. according to this Bach. Not according to this Bach. As far as a second time around, the original time. The original time, well, you're right, according to this Bach or Taz, if you were to be able to remove the, the milk altogether, you're right. You're right, yeah, according to this Bach, if you were to remove but you don't remove it, then it's there. It was Asr, it remains Asr. But here's the problem. Yeah. They do not factor the effect of the meat became Asr yeah. on the rest of the meat. Yeah, listen, it's a Shveri Bach. No, why, it, why it, can uh, they ignore that? Yeah. 
the meat, as you say, yeah. became asr and remains asr. It remains asr, yeah. Forget about milk. Forget about, Forget about milk. 24 if hours, yeah. a piece yeah. of meat becomes asr for any reason We whatsoever. hold it's always asr. And it remains asr. Yes, it does. It's because it comes from a tray of animals. Right. There's no milk involved. But now, you want to tie Wait a second. Yeah. Will, will the taste of that meat asr a different piece of meat? Not necessarily. That's a, what the box says. A piece of meat, a yeah. piece of meat that came from a trefa animal. Traf, yes, trefa animal, yes. Because that piece of meat is an iser in itself. Yeah, but this this is different than a piece so of meat. So here the box says the piece of meat itself is not an iser. It is, but the iser, what makes it usur, part of it is go, is not completely usur. But after the piece of meat hours. remained an iser after yes. it became an iser as chanan. Yes. Then it should. Then the piece of meat, not the milk, should ask a different yeah. piece of meat. Yeah. Well, that's what the shach says. Apparently, that's what the shach doesn't like. Right. But if the bach doesn't right. say so, then obviously then the because he holds, so when I eat he holds that the bus of bechol are, are two separate entities. That's what the primitive so brother explains. So, so, if, yeah. so if the, the, the yeah. bach holds that the meat itself. Yeah. Once the milk is in the Wilnotem Tam Nefgam, the meat that was absorbed the first time around no longer constitutes an Isser with respect to the second meat. Yeah. You didn't get that. It was a long sentence. Yeah. Let me say that again. What is that? Yeah. Let me say that again. The meat that was uh, that absorbed the bus, the, the challah, the first time around. Right. If the Bach holds that once the milk becomes Nogten Tam Nefgam, that meat does not the, usher the remaining meat. Just the meat not, yeah. So then, yeah, the he doesn't hold that what became an iser remains.